there's a huge amount of number of cats out there with heart disease. There was um, a recent study um, at London which just reiterated this, and I'll, I'll mention it as we go along. So the question is when you see a cat that's got a murmur or gallop sound or even actually has no, no uh, abnormal findings on physical exam at all, is first of all, has this cat got heart disease? And then is, well, if it has, how bad is it? And uh, does it need treating now? Uh, what do I treat it with? And should I breed from this cat? I don't think you can answer any of those questions without an echo. I've got a cat downstairs at the moment that's recently been in heart failure, so it presented to Snick. It's got no murmur, no arrhythmia, no gallop sound. It's got life-threatening heart disease. Equally well, there's a cat downstairs with a murmur that's got no heart disease. So to identify what the cause of murmur, gallop, arrhythmia is, you've really got to do an echo. And it's on that basis that you decide how bad it is and therefore whether it warrants treating. Now we can argue about whether we've actually got any evidence basements as to how we should treat cats. Uh, it's pretty scanty. Uh, but nevertheless, if it was my cat, I'd scan it. If it had a murmur, if it was my cat, it had certain findings, I'd treat it. And uh, it would certainly affect what drugs I would treat it with as to what its um, echo appearance was.